What's up guys, Johnny here, back with a brand new Call of Duty Mobile video. Today I unlocked my very first gold camel. I wanted to share it with you guys, but also I want to share a bunch of tips that, uh, yeah, I just learned on the fly by playing, and I want to make your life easier, guys. So today we look at the gunsmith, the camels, and some tips to unlock faster, and maybe save on some XP cards also. Now before we start, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel for daily card mobile videos. Let's get into it. Well, first of all, my first gold camo is not the AK-117, guys. I've been working on the AK all day on stream, but I didn't finish. I moved to something else. I decided to go for my secondaries, the pistols, the rocket launchers, and the knife. And at the same time, I'm working on some ARs. So my first gold camo is going to be the MW-11. I also want to show my loadout because uh, the last challenge you have to do with most of your weapons will be the headshots. I needed 45 headshots with the pistol, but I got like 25 in my last two games. Seriously, this loadout is nuts. But yeah, let's look at the camo feature and how it works. When you're in your loadouts, you can select a weapon and go to gunsmith. On the gunsmith, you can select five attachments. You can remove an attachment for the optics or another attachment for a perk. But like here i wanted to go for as much accuracy as possible without losing some range or still having a pretty decent fire rate so this like i think max accuracy you can get is like 82 84 maybe but this right here extra fire rate super high accuracy and a little bit of extra range a very very good loadout i'm gonna go into more details later in another video but now i want to talk about the camo so how the camos work is by leveling up your weapons, you unlock series of camos. And you have to do kills, headshots, and a bunch of different stuff depending on, on the weapons. But once you're done, and you see 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10. Once you're done unlocking all the camos, you can get your gold gun. And to unlock the gold gun, I'm going to have to play one more game with my pistol after unlocking all the camos. So we're going to do it right now. Now on top of that, if you have all pistols in gold, you're going to get the platinum. If you have all rocket launchers in gold, you're going to get the platinum camo. Same thing for SMGs, but it's going to take a while to grind all the SMGs or all the ARs in gold. Uh, but after that, if you have all weapons in the game in gold, then you're going to get the Damascus. It's going to be a long grind, guys. Now, one major tip I wanted to share with you guys is because, you know, I'm going to have to level up my J358. It's level six. I cannot unlock all my camos until it's max, max level. And I'm going to have to also uh, level up my Type 25. And I try to do it without wasting XP cards. So what I did is while I was working on my pistol, I equipped my Type 25 and you can see it's, it's on all my loadouts. I put Type 25 on all my loadouts. So while I work on my SMRS, my Type 25 is going to level up. And while I work on my MW11, my Type 25 is going to level up. It's level 19 already. And it was level 13 when I started my pistol. So I gained like 6 plus levels just by not even using it. And I didn't waste XP cards. I didn't waste double XP because my MW was already maxed out. So I didn't want to waste anything. But I'm like passively leveling up my Type 25 while playing with my pistol. Now, once I'm done with my pistol, I might play with the Type 25 and level up my SMRS or something else on the side, you know? So that's what I try to do for the start at least. Now, while doing this, you're not wasting XP cards just to level up a weapon. You just level them up passively. All right, so we're just going to do a quick game on Kill House because uh, it's the fastest way, I think, to just complete the game. Uh, don't need to get headshots anymore, I'm done. But we just need to finish a game while using it. Uh, I could just use my Type 25 if I want to, but I want to show you guys the pistol loadout because it's actually pretty insane. I like the new animation, by the way. So this pistol um, is very accurate. It's very, very accurate. And uh, it's got a pretty good fire rate. And uh, you, can, you can pretty much shoot, shoot enemies from across the map here oh yeah that was a, another uh, a medal you had to do is uh, kill enemies at long range and here i'm gonna burst because uh it's pretty far there's a dude there got him these nuts got one dude Oof. Oof. They got me. It's a close game, guys. 
All right, we got the final kill. So yeah, mm -hmm. insane fire rate, but I'm gonna do another video about that. Uh, how to get easy headshots and and what's the best loadout for the MW11. In, in my opinion, it's probably the best loadout for the MW11. Great pistol for real. It's my favorite pistol in the game. All right, we got the gold camel just by completing a game after you got all the other camels. So we're just gonna check what it looks like in the game real quick. So we're gonna go back to the gunsmith and we're gonna equip that gold camel right here the bottom there you go equip look at this and, and someone told me in the youtube comments if you put it on max uh, max graphics the uh, the charm is gonna be moving because i said earlier it's not moving in the game so we're gonna check it out and then there's the platinum and it says uh, unlock all gold camos for weapons of the same gun type so there's two pistols we're gonna do the other one tomorrow so as you can see i'm on very high graphics so we're gonna try to pay attention and see if the the charm is moving let's play so is the charm moving i don't even see it for real we're gonna try to oh we're gonna have to check oh yeah it is moving see the charm is moving all right good to know guys my bad I'm, i said it's not moving on my previous video anyways this is the pistol the gold gold camo and it's looking pretty shiny for real very nice very Lost nice skin at long range you gotta burst though because it's accurate but at, at medium range you try to get headshots you're gonna get headshots but at long range it's not a weapon for that like it's not a sniper see that's a medium range kill you can go for it at this range but across the map it's a bit harder hey dude Oof. Come on, dude. Extended mag would have been nice here, but I removed it. I no longer use extended mag. Changing mags. We good? I was trying to go. Oh man, I'm out of ammo. So that's what I do. If I'm out of ammo, I don't use vulture because uh, <laughs> cause shipment is a freaking mess anyway. So you die. You die a lot. And if I ever run out of ammo, I just get some kills with my Type 25 until I die. And at the same time, I'm working on the Type 25 progression. Uh, yeah, I want to do my AK-17 instead, but but my AK-17 is max level, and the Type 25 is not. So I might as well get XP on the Type 25. You're gonna see at the end of the game, even if I barely use my Type 25, it's getting XP just because I'm just because I'm using it, you know. And the sounds completely different after the update. All right, so this is the end of the game. That was the gold camel pistol, my very first gold camel. I think I'm gonna do both pistols and both rocket launchers to start. Probably I'm gonna do the knife after because I'm not motivated to go for knife kills. There's a lot of stupid missions. Like the rocket launcher, you gotta get kills while crouch. You gotta get like 18 double kills with the rocket launcher. That's very, very random. So yeah, there's a few missions that will be frustrating for the gold camels. But yeah, some guys won't go for it. I mean, I understand. I don't know if you guys are going to grind gold camels. Are you just going to grind your favorite weapons? Or are you going to go for all the weapons in the game? There's a lot of weapons and it takes some time. Especially the ARs. You need 600 kills each. So it's quite a grind. So anyways, that was my first gold camel. The MW11. I think it's beautiful, guys. I really love what they did very shiny at max graphics uh the charm is moving at max graphics also i don't know if you guys knew and again the tips uh level up two weapons at the same time so if you're working on one weapon try to equip something else on the side so it's gonna gain xp at the same time it's not a bad thing now after the games you can always go back and check out your camels and see what you have to do to unlock the camels for example here i need to get uh, long distance skills with my type 25 and I need to get um, some hip fire kills and stuff like that so like most weapon will require you to get headshots hip fire long distance skills there, there's a lot of stuff to do so anyways that's gonna be it for today if you enjoyed the video make sure you smash the like let me know in the comments how you like the new update so far 
I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.